Reverend Father Fighting Cancer found himself in a battle with a bike thief this week. Como for Problem Solver Elisa Jaffe tells us why the grandpa from Everett was finally fed up. This is the bloodied face of a grandpa fed up with bike thieves. It just never occurred to me that he wouldn't just drop the bike the moment he saw me coming, but he didn't. After a ride with his grandson, Brian Anderson stopped at this Everett Park. While Gabriel played, Anderson confronted a guy with bolt cutters and his brand new $1,100 bicycle, his third bike stolen in two months. He held it up in front of him, kind of like a shield, and I grabbed onto it and we pulled back and forth for a while, and then he let go with one hand and just walloped me. The thief rode away, leaving Grandpa needing 10 stitches. I saw that his blood was gushing really badly. Bikes have been big for Anderson since he was a boy. Now that he's fighting leukemia, biking provides an escape from chemo. We'll ride through the woods and just be tearing it up and laughing, just laughing, because, hey, I'm, I, I got cancer, but man, <laughs> this is fun. <laughs> Anderson scoured pawn shops searching for his wheels, knowing he probably shouldn't buy another since he's out of work. It was a 19 inch 2011 Rock Hopper. So the problem solvers contacted the bike shop where he bought his ride. Heart sort of went out to him when uh, this happened to you a third time, I guess. And uh, Bicycle Centers of Everett uh, and Silver Lake, I would actually like to present this bike to you. Free of charge today. Thank you. A free bike, but Anderson's face paid the price. In Everett. I need a couple more of those big locks. Alisa Jaffe, Como 4 News.